Hello, Kyle from Offer Consulting. Today I'm going to talk about a product we purchased through Quadratech. It is the Bubba Rope Toe Strap. It's actually their Black Op line. Now, I'm not a big fan of using the term toe strap for a recovery strap. A toe strap is more for a strap for light pulls, dragging up a gravel road, um, towing a vehicle to a gas station that broke down a half a mile from the gas station, things like that. It's a very lightweight strap where a recovery strap is designed more for the forces and rigors that are associated with a recovery, a stuck vehicle. But unboxing this thing comes with a nice bag to store it in. It feels nice. Comes with your warranty card for the product, which says your 12 month limited warranty protection begins from the date of your purchase. You must register within 30 days of the receipt date. A sticker, of course, most important part of the packaging. And then this sleeve was over top of the strap, which of course shows a picture of it, but then it also says it's a three inch by 20 foot toe strap up to 47,000 pounds braking strength. We'll get into that in a second. Made from 100% US nylon webbing, nylon stretches, polyester does not. So the nylon allows for a little bit of elasticity. The elongation 6% for easier towing. That means it'll stretch up to 6%. High vis reflection tape, which is on the edge of the strap, which makes it very nice, especially being a dark strap for the visibility. Certified braking strength labeling, which is this nice bright orange tag. Reinforced Cadora covered tapered eyes, which is really nice and thick. Really uh, great protection on the end of these eyes. And the mesh duffel bag included, of course. Ideal for towing, Jeeps and trucks. Then on the inside of this, it has the braking strength information. It has the care instructions and the certified load test that shows where they got that information from. So they marked it at 23.5 as a straight line pull braking, but the peak load was actually 24.5. So it gives it a little extra there for accuracy. Now it comes with a nice Velcro strap to hold it all together. On this tag, which is sewn into the strap. Braking strength, 23.5 in a straight or vertical pull. 18.8 is in a choker where it loops around itself, goes back through the eye and you pull it tight and makes a, a loop on it. And 47,000, which is called a vertical basket, where it goes in a U, like around a tree, or if you fold the strap in half, makes for 47,000 pounds of braking strength. So it's a very strong, well put together strap. It feels good, it's got nice thickness to it. The thick eyes, easy to stow. Has a nice strap here to contain it so it's not unwinding itself in your vehicle every bump you hit. It's just a nice quality built, made in the USA recovery strap. Now if you're wondering how to use a recovery strap, stay tuned to our page our YouTube channel, we are going to be creating more videos on how to use a, a recovery strap. What's the difference between a recovery strap, a toe strap, a kinetic energy rope, a snatch strap, how to hook them up, when would you use them. We're going to go through the processes over the next couple videos, so stay tuned. We're also going to have a lot more pieces of equipment that we talk about. I have a lot of gear here, so we're going to start going through stuff, talking about different pieces of equipment. The reason why? I want you to be able to buy what you need and not get suckered into buying $10,000 worth of wasted gear. But there's very few places where you can open up a package and hold the stuff and play around with the stuff. That's why we have our classroom with all the gear we have is because we want you to be able to touch and feel the stuff and decide what you want to buy before you go and buy it. So you don't get caught in the trap of spending unnecessary money on things you do not need. Thank you for your time.